and let's get to it. Okay, we are... Oh man, we are... First thing we are doing is combining these two Gundam Beam Sabers. It'll be the simple one, uh, thing to do. Oop, more uh, skills than I can use. Uh, hit increases... Attack hit increases your gauge. Um, I assume burst gauge is what they mean. Um, which... Hmm. I think I'm going to... Uh, give up shield damage for that. I think that's the one that I'm most likely to uh, get to live without. There we go. Um, what else we got? Uh, we've got Mark II Beam Sabers, and a lots of them. So we'll be combining those. Uh, repair on something. Uh, cancel combo damage. Man, it actually does give specific bonuses for ca uh, canceling uh, from one move to another. That's interesting. And something damage. S something about death. I wish I could read all this, because I bet there's some nifty stuff going on in here. Oh well. Uh, shield damage and some other kind of damage, and let's do this. Okay, Hyper uh, Beam Sabers. I have a main one that's level 16, but now the purple one's going to be level 16. It's going to be under Great Swords, I'm certain. Two-handed swords. Yeah, where is it? It's the two things you pass, Rob. There we go. Okay, and it looks... Okay, the Epion Beam Sword is new. That won't need combining. That will be convenient. Level 16. Merge again. Two-handed sword. Hyper Beam Saber. And it ups this skill and adds cancel combo damage. So, hey. Okay, moving right along. A bunch of Wing Beam Sabers. I don't need this one. But I do need to combine... Oh... These other four? Yeah, these other four. Uh, start with the blue one and work my way down. Um, there they all are. That's easy, at least. Okay, I have to pick skills. Um, I have seven skills. I have six slots. So what do I get rid of? Shield damage. Saber DPS, obviously, I'm keeping. Um, EX charge, I'm keeping. I'm going to do the shield damage. I don't really care about shield damage that much. There we go. Um, okay, get these wing beam sabers combined and out of my life. Uh, piercing slash specifically. Um, plus 50% damage. That's an awfully good uh, thing to have. Um, I think that's mid-air combo damage or mid-air attack damage. Um, I don't think... I think piercing, you know... Giving Piercing Slash an extra 50% of power would be more important than uh, juggle damage, really. Maybe I'm wrong, but it all depends on, you know, how I use these if and when I ever use them. I have no idea what that says, but I get 30 more percent of it if I take it. Um, but I don't think I'll take it, because I actually know what most of the skills I have are. Okay, moving down the list. Yeah, Epion Beam Sword, it totally new. Hyper Beam Sword, I'm pretty sure, yeah, that's... Yeah, I think that's... Is that the Gundam Axis? Um... How do I find out? I probably don't, so I'll just let it go. Given that that is, I think, a Gundam Double X weapon, it probably is. Yeah, I'm, uh, the Hyper Beam Sword all, uh, is... I want... If I could see how it wraps around the hand... Okay, yeah, it's a, that's the Gundam Axis Sword, because it has a handguard... Okay, a pair of Ale Strike Beam Sabers. Definitely combining for the extra skill. There it is. Okay, well, it upgrades one of my existing skills. Uh, whatever that one is that I'm not sure about, it ups it by... Oh, a percentage. An actual whole percent. Well, I don't know if it's a whole percentage, but it's at least part. Uh, combine these Strike Noir Swords. But yeah, I swear the... Uh, 
I swear the, uh, yeah, this is the ones. I swear the uh, extended MS and Action Strike Noir did not have that, uh... Okay, these are two different models of... No, they're not. They are both Strike Freedom, so we'll be combining the level 10 green ones with the level 20, uh... Uh... Level 20 words, which apparently I'm not a high enough level to use. Level 20 ones, the level 20 beam sabers, because it should, uh, be pretty good. Yeah. Uh, cancel combo damage, etc. Okay, that's pretty good. Now, that's within spitting distance of my current hand weapon. I haven't done twin sabers yet. Maybe I'll give it a, a spin sometime soon. Hmm... Let's see, going down the list. Uh, GN Sword, I don't even need the old one, which is nice. Um, GN Sword 3 is actually stronger than what I'm using. Huh. That's a temptation, but it also has no special ability, so that's probably why I didn't do it. Okay, we will combine the uh, purple... Turn A Twin Beam Sabers with the uh, green ones of the same level, which gives them a bunch of skills. Uh, EX Action Charge, Parts Break EX Charge, Chance of Parts Breaking. Well, those are all very complimentary at least, so that's good. And next. Okay, I did not need that level uh, MS hand, but I could com I couldn't it couldn't hurt to have this one, which gives uh, I think a higher chance of parts break and repair on hit to the fairly strong martial arts hand. So hey, sure. Okay, now off to the uh, off to other weapons. Top of the list. Um, don't need these ground gu this ground Gundam rifle. Don't need that Gundam Alex rifle. Um, do need this Hyper Mega Launcher, for sure. Go down to Long Rifles. Hyper Mega Launcher. There it is. Yeah, which I probably shouldn't have done, because the one I gave up had Fire Element, which does not carry over. But, ah. Okay, I had a Fryru uh, rifle, but that one is better. Uh, a pair of Dovin Wolf rifles that need combined. There it is. Uh, which. Ah, uh, has. Which increases the power of shot barrage. Uh, beam smart guns have those. New hyper bazooka is entirely new. Don't need to be worrying about anything. Uh, the standard wing buster rifle is also just straight up new. Don't need to worry about that. Don't need to combine the old twin busters. Uh, Proto Zero, it looks like I do, so we'll do that. Double rifle. Uh, there it is. Did I just... I just did the wrong ones. I'm a genius. So I just did my standard Endless Waltz Twin Buster Rifles. Damn it. This does get confusing after a while. Honestly. Um... Is it under, is it under a long rifle instead of... No, it's not. Not going to be under Machine Gun or Gatling. It's not a bazooka. Was it just not showing up? I'm confused now. I'm very confused. Because... The Twin Buster rifles I wanted to combine with apparently don't exist? Oh, there it is. It's a long rifle as opposed to a... Okay, well, fine, whatever. So I'll need another, uh... I'll need another, uh... Standard Wing Zero Custom Twin Buster Rifle when the time comes, and that's fine. 
A uh, mega cannon. Oh, it's so close to the Gatling I can't even see it. Uh, beam cannon for the serpent. I think that's the Tall Geese 3's uh, gun. Serpent's bazooka. Okay, since I managed to... Since I managed to... Uh, beam rifle shorty, don't need two of those. So I managed to take the new symbol off of everything while I was searching for what I did wrong. Uh, this is going to take a minute. GN beam submachine gun. Well, that'll be under machine guns at least. That should be... Yep. Theoretically easy. Okay. Um, Jinx short and long barrel rifles. GN bazooka. Hyper Dawes rifle. Um, okay, it looks like the... Uh, Well, I didn't. I don't need to keep that Jim Sniper beam rifle because just the one. I don't know why it sorts to the bottom of the list. That's weird. Ah, the high new Gundam head is new. Let's go to the top of the list. I uh, gotta combine these Dom heads. Uh, extra health off of this one. That's good. Um, if custom arms need combined, where are you? Where, there we go. Um, I wish by removing the blade antenna skill you could take the antenna off the thing just for, you know, variety's sake. Don't need that white gym custom head. Do need to combine these two gym two heads. Where? There. Okay. Need to combine all three of these Dovin Wolves. One of the early, like, I think actually from when Double Zeta was airing in the 80s, uh, one of the uh, boxes for mo the model kit at that point actually said Dubin Wolf. Getting stuff from Japanese over to English. Well, don't need that. I had a better Zeta gun, a double Zeta head, or I just got one, I forget which, but either way. But getting Japanese over to English is difficult. But at least it's difficult in a way that can be entertaining for, uh, sometimes for both parties. Gear and Yakdoga. High new Gundam head. That's new. Unicorn. Dryson. Uh, Wing Gundam Endless Waltz Heads, Wing Gundam Zero, and Proto Zero. Yeah, so we've got TV Wing, we've got Endless Waltz Wing, Wing Zero, and Wing Proto Zero. I think Breaker 2 had all of those. And Epion's head is new. Tall Geese 3 does not need to combine those heads. Does need to combine these, though. There we go. There we are. Okay, Serpent Custom. Don't need that. The level 20 head, though, could combine with the next one down. Where are you? You are right here. Oops, I need to... Hmm. I'm going to give up on... I don't know, Bazooka... I'm going to give up on long rifle DPS. I don't use this super often. And uh, the Serpent's two main weapons are a machine gun and a uh, bazooka, so it makes more sense to have those two. Let's gun them heads. Well, we will be skipping that one and then combining... Let's see. I'm going to... Ha I have some duels to combine too, but... We're going to combine all Blitz Gundam heads with the Golden Blitz. Which amounts to two heads. Well, this one just enhances a couple of the skills it had. A long rifle and health. Nothing wrong with that. And now we'll get the lower level one. There it is. Uh, Gatling DPS. Sure, why not? 
and dual Gundam heads. There we go. And Stargazer, I had a level 20 head, don't even need that one. Uh, gold for Mamatsu, keep the best one, throw the rest away. Yeah, look how much money these all this merging is costing me. I'm going to have to uh, do some bounty mode soon. Doven Wolf Head is new. Top of the list. Uh, uh, Jim Custom can just throw that one away and keep the green one. Jim 2, throw the level 7 away. Uh, Wing Zero, that was new. Nothing to combine it with. Very nice. Epion, Tall Geese 3 doesn't need combined. Uh, Serpent Torsos do. And there it is. Let's see, Providence, don't need the level 10 at all. Strike Noir. Mm, looks like I can kill that one, but I need to combine these other two. There we go. Uh, I can kill the Stargazer Torso while I'm at it. Uh, okay, where are you, Strike Noir? There we go. Um, got to combine those stargazers. Where were you? There you are. Um, getting there. Age three fortress. That's just totally new. Does not need combining. That's all the body parts. Now. All the torsos, so now we just have to do this. Okay, arms. Tall Geese 3. Uh, kill the two lower level ones, but I do need to combine this. Well, let's go to the top of the list. Uh, nothing, 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 nothing. And Gym Custom. Well, guess what? Where are you, Jim Custom? There it is. Level 13. Now I get the one that was a lower level. All that effort to try and avoid landing on the Gerber Tetra arms and did it anyway. Oh well, that's life. Kill that one. Didn't need to merge anything anyway, so it's not a big issue. Uh, Jim 2 arms need merged, though. Uh, whip DPS and some type of attack power, I think. Um, okay, we're going to be merging a lot of wolves here. Where are you? There you are. We'll start with the level 12 and then go to the other blue one, which should give it, I think, four powers? Five? Something like that. Uh, well, four counting movable frames, so fewer in general than I expected, but still power. Not unlimited power, though. Saw the trailer for Star Wars The Last Jedi last week, like most everybody else. Um, and I think it looks nice, so... Hopefully it will be an enjoyable movie. Uh, there's absolutely no way to tell anything worth telling from the trailer. It's, it's pretty. We expected a Star Wars movie to be pretty. Or if we didn't, we weren't paying attention for the last, you know, 30 years. Those wing gun parts are new. Uh, wing Zero, that's an improvement. Proto Zero can ditch the old one. Sandrock Kai... Well, I'll have to combine the level 10 and level 12. 
Repeat. There we go. There it is. Great sword DPS. Um, don't need these Mitaku arms. The Epion arms are new. These Tall Geese 3 arms need combined. And I just unnude some things, but I'll be able to tell by the name, so it'll be fine. Hopefully. Uh, Blitz Duel. Don't need those. Um, do need to combine these two Assault Shroud Arms. There we go. Providence. Don't need the old ones. Strike Rouge. Do need to combine those two. Where? Strike Rouge. There we go. And Stargazer. Don't need to combine those. I'm getting there. Destiny Gundam Arms. Yeah, I need to be combining a bunch of those. And there they are. That puts me over whip. Martial arts, twin blade, great sword. Oh let's kill great sword. I don't use it much, so and it's not a very big boost, so let's mix this with the other destiny arms and see what skills we need to be ditching. Um, we're going to kill Twin Blade, actually Whip, because I don't use it very much compared to other weapons, and it's the lowest boost I see. I think that's Attack Multiplier, something like that. Or Defense, something. Okay, we are going, we have got a lot of work to do on Akatsuki parts. We've got to get this up to level 13 and then combine it with the other two things for the powers and etc, etc. Okay. Powers for everyone. Actually, no, just for me. And almost there. Akatsuki, and I've unnewed all the Amatsus, but I know what I'm looking at, so that's okay. Yeah, okay. Yep, it only enhances a power I already had, so that's fine. Amatsu, don't need that level 13. Do need to merge the 13 and the 11. And there we go. Okay, getting down the list. Uh, don't need the age 2 double bullet. The age 3 fortress stays... And I think, yeah, that's it for that. That just leaves legs, backpacks, and shields, so... To the top. Gym 2, those don't need combined. Dove and Wolf, those need combined. There we go. Um, full armor double Zeta are new. That's good. Uh, keep going. High new. The, okay, I had a pair of level 20 high new legs. This will definitely need combined with the uh, higher rarity ones. There we go. Now, going down the list. Uh, wing Zero. Those are new. Don't need to combine anything that's new. Uh, likewise, the Nitaku legs are new. Or no, excuse me, uh, Shenglong Endless Waltz. That's Nataku, and those do need combined. And... There we go. Technically, no, I just used up the Shenglong Endless Waltz because I made the same mistake twice. Awesome. Yes, the, the ones that are actually Gundam Nataku, they say Ultron Gundam, because that is, a, of course, the actual name. But, uh... 
But, ah, possibly a new power for my existing legs. Look for Serpent Custom Legs. But, of course, they called it Gun Nataku on the uh, package just so they wouldn't have uh, two... Just the same reason they added custom to all the other uh, to all the other Endless Vault suits so that they wouldn't have, uh, you know, models with the exact same name on the shelf. Okay, well, that upgrades one of my existing powers. Uh, I think it's melee. Either way, made myself a little stronger here. Uh, strike Noir can ditch the old legs. That's nice. Uh, don't see any duplicates through here to worry about. Hope I'm loud enough here. Um, well, we'll mix the two age two double bullet legs. That'll be easy enough. There's that. Uh, going down. Almost there. Okay, that's just these backpacks and shields. Both of which tend to be like the... Well, ba and backpacks not so much, but shields tend to be the latest uh, category because not everything has a shield. So... Gym custom. Yeah, some combining to do there. Where? There. Okay, that. And that. Ah, thruster capacity increase, all for that. Uh, gym 2s don't need combined, that's done. Dovin Wolves, uh, 2 out of 3. Uh, gym 3s won't need combined, so let's do the Wolves. Where? Werewolf. There, Wolf. Their castle. Um, S Gundam. I didn't have the standard S Gundam backpack, just the goofy booster unit one, so. Sazabi is new. High new. May as well be new. Banshee Norn. Can ditch the old one. B2 Buster. They do need combined. There it is. Okay. Uh, Shining Gundam backpacks most definitely do not need combined, nor the Master... Well, I have three Master Gundam backpacks, and two of them do. And where am I looking? There we go. This is on one of your builds. I think I just got that warning. Uh, Wing Zero, don't need the old one. Proto Zero, gotta combine them. Uh, Dust Scythe Hell, a uh, fair bit of combining to do there too. Okay, where is Other Hell? There it is. Ah, straight up health boost. I'm all for it. Uh, Ultron. I've got four of them. Only two need combined. Good. And I need to combine these. Epion. All right. Tall Geese 3, no combining needed. And... Don't need that. Uh, don't need to combine those. Providence is straight up new. Uh, let's see. Can... I've got a combined pair of Strike Noir and a pair of Stargazer backpacks. Please. There we go. And Stargazer. Alright. 
Getting there. Almost done with that. And strike freedom, no combination necessary. Uh, Owashi Akatsuki, no, no combination necessary. Various strays, gold from Amatsu, no combination necessary. Mm. So I've worked a couple of parts and I'll have to get them replaced eventually, but I'll get the drops as they come. That's about all I can say at the moment. And shields! We've reached the home stretch. Uh, gym custom shield, the middle one doesn't need combined, the other two do. There we go. Which ups beam guard. That's a good thing. Um, Giradoga shields. Gonna combine this with the level 17. Where is it? Where are you, Doga? There it is. There we go. Um, Sazabi unicorn, etc., etc., etc. Uh, beam mantle, those, let's see, those are, yeah, those are all the same thing, and they need to be combined. Then there's some Shenglong shields to go deal with, it looks like. Um, uh, Shenglong shield 10, 12 endless waltz, so, yeah, those do need to be combined, two endless waltz ones. There we go. Epion shield is new, so don't have to do anything with that. Uh, freedom and justice shields. Don't get the two mixed up. We're mixed. And that's it. Okay, we have done it. That is our... Uh, that is today's Saturday sorting special. And we will be back on Monday, so see you then.